Round 3 of the previously announced balance changes to Elite Dangerous just went live on the forums this time covering off combat bonds, anti xeno combat and delivery missions. Sit tight and we'll break down what we know. If you enjoyed this video remember to subscribe to the channel and turn on notifications and if you'd like to support our work you'll also find us on Patreon. Links to everything you need are in the description below. So first out the gate here's the changes to combat bonds. High end NPC combat bonds will see an increase of between 80,000 to 400,000 credits. These changes are in line with last weeks changes to bounty payouts as was the case last week right now the HUD will not reflect the new amount paid out but the transaction tab in your ship will. Anti xeno combat is also getting a buff with combat bonds there now being worth 4 times as much. Also the experience gained towards pilot combat rank is being rescaled as part of the balance change. This does mean that Thargoid scouts will now not grant as much combat experience as they used to however kills for larger Thargoid ships will now scale appropriately according to their difficulty all the way up to Hydra. The amount of XP granted will also be adjusted to reflect how many pilots contributed to the kill and their own respective combat ranks. Off the back of the changes made to mineable commodities at the beginning of this process an adjustment has also been made to delivery missions to better reflect the distance travelled and the amount of goods being shipped. So how will these changes affect you? Do you think the increase in combat bonds is high enough and is the change to Xeno combat experience points going to seriously affect your charge towards combat elite? Sound off in the comments below. That's it for now. Thanks very much for watching. We'll be back later this week with more videos. Until then 07 CMDRs follow the greens on the way out and do keep clear of the toast rack. We very much look forward to seeing you next time.